Hi, this is Julie with Beetaholic, and today I'm going to show you how to make this earring. I wanted to create a project that used wire um, in a fun way that wasn't too complicated, so it'd be an easy introduction to wire if you're not too familiar with working with it, but a really pretty design will result. What you're going to need is you're going to need some wire. For this particular project, I've chosen this silver-plated fancy square German style wire and it has a really pretty kind of texture design to it already so the wire itself is going to add a lot to the design. And then I have a coin shaped purple crazy lace agate bead and it's got a hole through the middle and a little silver plated earring hook. In terms of the tools you'll need a pair of cutters, a round nose plier, a chain nose plier, and a ruler. And that's it. So to make this project, we're going to take our wire and we're going to cut seven and a half inches. If you want your spirals to be a little larger, cut a little more. If you want them to be a little smaller, cut a little less. So we're just going to make that snip. Now we're going to go ahead and thread the wire through the hole in the bead and we're going to scoot it down to about the midway point doesn't have to be exactly perfect, but you want it pretty much in the middle. Once you've done that, you're going to take one of the wires and fold it over the top arch of your bead. And then you're going to do the same thing with the other wire. Now where they crisscross in the middle, you're going to twist. Just one twist. Now we need to create our spiral. To do that, go ahead and using your round nose plier, so we're going to grab the tip of the wire and we're going to make a loop. Now go ahead and continue making a spiral just like so. Grab it with your chain nose and flatten it out in case it got a little bit wonky. And now we're going to take our chain nose and just literally coil our wire. We're just kind of walking this circle along the edge of the wire, just spiraling it. And do that until you can't do it anymore. There we go. And now we're going to go ahead and do that on the other side. So we want to switch back to our round nose. And again, make a spiral and go a little bit beyond one full spiral, just so we have a little curly cue there. And again, grab it. With your chain nose and keep spiraling. There you go. So you've got your two spirals. Now all we have to do is attach the hook, which is super easy. You're just going to open the loop at the base of the hook the same way you would open a jump ring. And we're just going to slip that between one of our rungs of our spiral, one of the top ones. And then we're just going to close that loop back up. So there we go. We've got our really fun pair of earrings which showcases a lovely gemstone bead and has a fun spiral motif.